Amen. No, no. Amen. We just thank God for you all. Tonight, amen, I'm not going to be before you too, too, too long. Amen. But I'm going to be, we're going to be talking about three set of people that you got to watch out for. Three set of people that you got to watch out for. Amen. And so we can move to it quickly and fast because, amen, I think, uh, amen, we, we, amen, some of y'all looking at that big clock. I can move it. Amen. Revival, I can move the clock. You all didn't see no clock. <laughs> I'm going to move it. <laughs> Amen. Because you're going to mess with the spirit it's about to do. You're going to move something that could work. Amen. 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 So I'll be, I'll be teaching on Amen. Three set of people that you got to look out for. Amen. In the world, in the workplace, and in the church. In the world, the workplace, and the church. Amen. And these, uh, these three set of people, things of God, that we got to look out for. Amen. Glory be to God. It means that, amen, if we don't really, if we don't really look out for, amen, these three, three street set of people, amen, we can, we can, we can, they can literally destroy us. We don't look out for the three people, set of people. Father, I pray God that your word, as your word has already been blessed. The Bible says forever, God, that word is settled in heaven forever. Father, I pray God that your word will be settled in our hearts and in, and in our mind. I thank God in advance, oh God, for the increase in Jesus' name. I thank God in advance for transformation in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And I give you praise. Let your word have free cause tonight. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen and amen. Now, the three set of people that we got to watch out for. Amen. Glory be to God. The three set of people sings of God. Amen. That you and myself have the watch out for. Amen. Glory be to God. Amen. Amen. The first one is pride. The first one is pride. We got to watch out, amen, for pride because those who come with pride, amen, they can really, truly, amen, they can really be, they can stop you or they can be a hindrance, amen, the, the ones that are full of pride, amen, they're so full of pride, you ever know, amen, anybody that is so full of pride, they tell they will not repent when they're wrong. Amen. And so anytime a person don't repent and they know they're wrong, that's pride. Because pride will make you think you're right when you're wrong. Amen. They will not repent. Amen. Because they are, they are full of pride. And, and the Bible says pride come before fall. And this is why we cannot allow ourselves to be full with pride. Amen. Amen. Just don't go to pride yet. Just yet the first one. Let me leave pride for the last. Amen. The first one is wicked people. The first one is wicked people. Do you know there's some wicked people in the world? There's wicked people on your job. And there's wicked people in church. I say wicked people in the world, wicked people on your job, and wicked people in the church. So hey, you can't escape it. If you ain't getting on the job, you can get in the world. If you miss in the world, you can get in the church because wicked people everywhere. Amen. They're everywhere. Amen. So number one, the first set of people you got to watch out for is wicked people. A wicked man or a wicked woman is not a sinner man and a sinner woman. A wicked person knows the way but choose not to go it. Amen. The wicked person knows how to do right but choose to do wrong. Amen. So yes, yes, see what the Bible says about wickedness. Amen. Yes, go to the book of, uh, amen, the, 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 the book of Proverbs chapter 4. Verse, verse 14 through 17. Proverbs chapter 4, verse 17. Verse 14 through 17. Proverbs 4, verse 14 to 17. If you have it, say Amen. Glory be to God. Go ahead, my brother. Well, you fast, boy, Jesus. <laughs> amen. Go ahead. Enter not into the part of the wicked. Enter not into the part of the wicked. Read in the way of evil men. You see, you see, don't follow the part of the wicked. Not the sinner. There's a difference between a sinner man and a wicked man. A sinner man just don't know God. 
That's why he's a sinner man. But the wicked man know God, but is not submitted to the God that he know. Amen. Go ahead, finish reading. Avoid it. Pass not by it. Uh huh. Turn from it. Y'all hear the the word said. Amen. Don't go into it. You gotta reward those who are wicked man, a wicked person. Read. And pass away. Uh huh. For they sleep not. See, wicked people don't sleep. They up, amen, trying to do mysteries. They up thinking about wickedness, how to destroy you. Amen. Because they're wicked, so they don't guess, they don't sleep. Go ahead. Except they have done mischief. Uh -huh. You see, they are sleep and tell it and do the evil. You wicked people don't go to bed. You sleep in the early. A wicked people up all night thinking how they're going to mess you up, thinking how they're going to destroy you, thinking how they're going to, amen, hinder you, thinking really hard how they are going to damage your reputation. A wicked person. Amen. So these kind of people that we want to stay far away from wicked people. Hallelujah. Yeah, we can love them, but you ain't got to be with them. You ain't got to be around them. You can love them, pray for them, but you don't have to be with them. Go ahead. Is taken away. Uh, their sleep is taken away. Why? Because they ain't sleeping. Yeah. Yeah. The wicked person don't sleep. My God. So all night they are thinking how to do wickedness. All night they are thinking how to do wickedness. They don't sleep. They don't sleep, Lord Jesus. Good Lord. The one that we got to stay away from the wicked people, the wicked. We got to stay away from the wicked. Amen. Because they will, I mean, they will kill you. Read. Unless they cause some to fall. Unless they cause some. You see, the problem of a wicked person, they are, see, the reason why they are doing mystery at night, because they hope for you to fall. You see that? They want you to fall. They want you to be exposed. This is wicked people. A wicked person don't cover. A wicked person expose. You see what I'm saying? So they ain't sleeping. They want you to buy some water. They are literally hoping that you will fall. We got the wicked people in the, on your job. Don't like you. You ain't got to do nothing. They're just wicked. Amen. They're just wicked. They got them. You meet them in the world. Amen. And you meet them in church. Oh, Jesus. You keep my God. It seems like they're everywhere. And in church, they can be ten times wicked. They're wicked in the ones that are in the world. Because in the church, they're supposed to know God and they're supposed to have the fear of God. So they are more wicked than the ones that are in the world. And they're everywhere, wicked people. Good Jesus, you got to stay away from them, man. Amen. Glory be to God. Amen. That's what the Bible says, you know. Not pastor, this ain't pastor, glory. This is the word of God. So if you ain't get mad who watching me, you better get mad with God. I'm only saying what thus says the Lord is his word. Amen. And if you're wicked, just repent. If this really, amen, is cooking your heart, don't think about it, just repent. And God will forgive you. Don't stay wicked. Repent. Amen. That's it, right? Go ahead, one more story, 16 or 17. Go ahead. Or they eat the bread of wickedness. Uh, they eat the bread of wickedness, read. And drink the wine of violence. My God, and drink the, the wine of violence. So wickedness move along with violence. Amen. They will be violent. Wicked and violent. Amen. We got to stay away from these set of people. Now let's go to Proverbs 6. And verse 18, 12 and 6 and verse 18. Go ahead. And heart that devises it, wicked imagination. My God. See the heart, my God, that means that all they do is think about wicked things, imagination. How to do something to somebody. Amen. How to destroy somebody. Their heart is consistent, uh, amen, of thinking, oh, wickedness, wickedness, wickedness. Oh, y'all thought it, it wasn't these, it, it wasn't those people that are wicked, wicked like this? Yeah, but we got some folks wicked just like this. Oh, my, they're so wicked, amen, they're so wicked. They're looking for every day, amen. They're glad when something happened to you. 
They rejoice when something happens to you. They tell everybody when you fall. They tell everybody. Hallelujah, wickedness. You got to stay away from them set of people. Amen. Because they mean you're no good. Go ahead. Feet that be swift in running to mischief. You see, they like to run without trouble. They are quick to carry trouble, carry news. Quick. Quick. Let me see how we can mess up now. Amen. I'm learning a lot about us, so let me just spread it. Amen. That's why, things of God, you've got to really, truly be designing who you're walking with. Because as a Christian, you can't walk with everybody. The problem is we are too nice. We don't want to hurt people's feelings. Paul, let me, I won't hurt your feelings. Amen. If I see that you're trying to destroy me, I can hurt your feelings quickly. Amen. I don't hurt your feelings. Amen. Hurting your feelings don't mean you don't like them. Amen. You open, yes, I open rebuke them. If they're supposed to be a Christian and doing wickedness, you got to expose their wickedness. Amen. You expose their wickedness. You got to look here. You can't. You're a child of God. Why are you so wicked? You need to repent. Amen. You're the child of God. You're wicked. A wicked man is a dangerous man. A wicked woman is a dangerous woman. Because all they think and imagine how they're going to destroy you. And destroy others that stand in their way. Because their nature is wicked. And that's all they know how to do. Is being wicked. Amen. And that's why I want to be around a sinner. Than to be around a wicked fool. Because a sinner. What they will say. If they know you're saved. They're going to hold their mouth. They're going to let nothing come out of their mouth that is unclean. And if something comes out of their mouth. Oh. I repent for him. I repent. I repent. It slip. I repent. But a wicked man, a wicked man will just let you. He will do any, say anything that comes out of his mouth. And have no respect. Amen. No reference for God. Amen. Because they're wicked. Amen. They're, they're wicked. Amen. Now just go to one more scripture. Amen. And then we're going to go to the second one. The second set of people that we need to look out for. Amen. The first one is a wicked man, a wicked woman, wicked people. Amen. The first one is a, first one is wicked people. Amen. Now let's go to uh, the book of uh, let's go to Philippians chapter two, verse two and three. Philippians chapter two, verse two and three. If you have it, say amen. Go. Okay. Hold it right there. Let's go to Proverbs six. Verse 12 through 16. Proverbs chapter 6, verse 12 through 16. Proverbs 6, verse 12 through 16. If you have it, say amen. Go ahead. A naughty person, uh -huh. a wicked man, mm. go ahead. Walk it with a forward mouth. Walk it with a forward mouth. My God, what's a forward mouth? Anybody know? Say whatever come out their mouth. Okay. They don't have no bridle for their lip. They don't care who they who hear them. Go ahead, have no filter. They say anything. It's justifiable. Read. He, he winked with his eyes. And he winked with his eyes. Do you know that? Do you think you've seen that kind of people? Stay away from them. Amen. Stay away from them. He winked with his eyes. He was a wicked man. Wicked. Oh, we can walk up and keep their eyes. <laughs> they come, they let you know their true nature. Read. He speaketh with his feet. He speaks. Oh, God, why this man wicked here? See, why is you saying something? He's saying something that's with his feet. Look at her. She, she really thinks she's saying anything. Yeah. Look at him. He really thinks he's. He is. He can open his mouth, but he's speaking with his feet. His feet is talking, look here. She don't know I'm gonna get her job. She, he, he, he don't know I'm gonna get him fired. Yeah, he gonna get fired today. And, he, and his mouth ain't moving, but his feet is moving. His feet is moving, nigga. The feet talking. His feet is talking. He ain't talking, but his feet is talking. Yeah, he think, he think he got the position, but not for me. I'm gonna get that. I've been there longer than him. 
Been there longer than her. I can make her life miserable on this job until she quit. That's a wicked person. They don't have to open their mouth, but they talk with their feet. And they wink with their eyes. And the Bible tells us, amen. The Bible, I'm telling you, God will expose all of them, you know. He will